we are still in a, a good position uh, in terms of the league. Um, I think uh, you know it's not uh, you know if you go a full season, it's always going to you're going to have you know kind of ups and downs if you like in terms of our form. Have we been as free flowing and uh, as we were early on in the season? You know, possibly not. But what you've got to remember is we're up against you know this league is demanding. This league is you know not just going to turn up and yeah, Mother will have a great start to the season. Let's say um, continue to have a great start. You've got a opposition out there that are trying to work you out and trying to combat you. And, and as I say, in this division, if you're not quite at it and you're you know, five or ten percent down. Um, you know, it's, it makes a big difference um, in those fine margins. So between winning and losing, you know, we've been just on the other side of those fine margins recently, and you know, it's up to us to try and turn that back round. But uh, you know, we know the division we're in. We know how hard we had to work to get to that position. It's up to us to try and maintain that now and and, uh, and push on again for this last part of the season. We just treat it as the next game for us. You know. Um, you know, yeah, you can you can lose momentum, but you can gain it again pretty quickly as well in football and. Um, it's another whole match for us. It's an opportunity, but you know we only have to look at uh, last week to realise if we're not we are that five or ten percent down that St Martin have got players that can hurt us. So that's been the message. Um, as I said, it's an unforgiving league uh, if you are slightly off it, and we plan to you know be back to um, you know back to as close to our best as we can. And you know tomorrow night's like another chance to show that. It's just part of the game, you know. It's part of football. It's always will be. Particularly in this country at this time of year, there's always the chance of games being called off um, every now and then. So you've got to be prepared to to play. And as a professional player and athlete, you've got to be prepared mentally and physically to deal with that. So you know, while we don't have a massive squad, there is there are players that are you know are itching to get their chance, their opportunity. And any time there is a, a lot of games in a small period of time, then it, it gives you a chance to prove that as a player. So. Um, yeah, it's you know we trust the squad, we trust the, the players that we've got still, and and um, as I said, even if the games are coming thick and fast, we we trust back ourselves to to deal with them. We've been used to playing against each other. I think Jim spoke about that as well in terms of our analysis. Uh, um, meetings been pretty similar in terms of the run up to the games and things like that. But listen, yeah, we, we know the threats. Uh, as I said, I keep harking back to it, but I think you only have to look at that. Uh, game last week to, to realise if we give you know the dangerous players too much space that they, they can hurt you but likewise I think they know our threats and I think in the previous games against St Martin this season we've shown that um, and it's up to us to show that again uh, in front of our home fans here tomorrow it's to win a game it's to win a game of football you know as it always is yeah what comes off the back of that is yeah we would be sitting four points clear in third position but more important to us is winning the game and particularly here in front of our own fans is um, is to win the game. It's pretty simple, and uh, as I said, get back to showing that energy and, and um, cohesion in the team, the way we attack, the way we defend as one, and 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 getting back to to to, to near our best. And you know, hopefully, if we can do that, then you know we'll have a, a decent end to this season.